Hey YouTube, it's me once again. I want to come by and make this quick video. Shout now to two of my favorite YouTubers, Sun Kiss Queen. <laughs> she is just our oh man. I, I say my road dog. That's what she is. That girl can drive and get you there, man. You feel so comfortable with her. And then the other shout out is to Journey with Jazz. I met her this morning, her video, and I just, you know, checking my, my channel out this morning. And then I saw her. And I said, I said, well, let me listen to this video. And when she came on, she was doing, uh, I would say she was channeling something. And the way she was doing it, it reminded me so much of myself when I was younger. It was, you know, the tears would come and uh, it was just a burden. And, and you knew you had to finish this for you to get some relief. The prophecy, that's what we call them back then, the prophecy. But she was channeling this energy and I said, oh my God. And I, while she was giving it, even though it was old, an older video, here I am praying that she could get the words out. But it refreshed my soul to see a young woman. And uh, she she did it. And she she's really good. So I told her that uh, I had just subscribed to her and how much she reminded me of my younger self. And I shut the computer off and I went in the kitchen to make me a cup of tea. And, you know, I got the water boiling and I said, let me get the sugar because I'm out of honey. And I looked in the cabinet. The sugar is way up there, almost at the ceiling. But my sons are tall people. So my oldest son, he's tall, he was taller and his wife was tall too. So they had rearranged the kitchen since they were living with me and the sugar was way up at the top. My youngest son, after the older son died, my youngest son and his husband moved in to take care of me. Well, I was sick, man. I, I I had went I went through that. That death was hard. And then plus I had to go through a shoulder surgery. So they stayed there with me until February. I had the surgery in, in November. But I said all that to say there he's tall and I couldn't reach the sugar bucket. So I drug a chair into the pantry and I got the sugar. I really did. I got it, got it down, put it on the counter. And then the regular sugar, the glass, you know, how you just pour your sugar, that little glass, it was empty. I said, well, let me open it up and fill it up. And then I went to use a scoop in the big sugar bowl to fill up that container. I did one scoop and I said, well, let's, it could do two scoops. So on the second scoop, I spilled all the sugar on the counter right next to my fresh hot dish water that i had just poured up i had my little bleach in it and it was i spilled i said oh man and it's you know in that kind of situation you can't scoop it up you're gonna spill all the sugar so i said well let me just swipe the sugar in the dish water it's just gonna be some sweet dish wash water my dish is gonna be sweet my hair is gonna be sweet so I did that. I washed a few little dishes that was in the sink. And I said, well, let me go in the bedroom and drink my tea. So I was sitting there drinking my tea. And it was good, sweet. And I turned the laptop back on. And Journey with Jazz was uh, making a video. I mean, the time was just right. If it was alive, I, we could have chatted. But I listened to her. And she was talking about sugar and she was making her some tea and she was talking about how you can sweeten up your life and just sweet the same thing i had i was going through at the same time about sugar because when i uh was uh, washing them dishes with the sugar in it i was just praying i said lord make my life sweet just just send me all everything sweet the sugar i'll be a sugar diabetes i just need some sugar in my life and oh it's just amazing so 
I don't know, coincidence. They say there's no such thing as coincidences. But it's amazing how Joy, I mean, not Joy, but Jazz, how she had, we were on the same tune. Because um, I, when I think about things that I used to happen to me and the things she was talking about, I mean, she does the cards and the tarot cards and Sunshine, uh, Sunkiss Queen, she does them too. I used to do them, and I do it sometimes, rarely, but uh, people that I know, they'll ask me for a reading. But I am not able to do these cards like y'all do them on the internet. I, my querent has to touch the cards. I, I just feel like the power of the person touching the card is is much greater in, the, in my presence. We're in the presence of each other. But a lot of times you can't do that. And um, it's, it's good that y'all can, the internet has closed all this gap. But I'm just still not able to feel comfortable doing the cards without the querent being in my presence. But I am so glad that these young women, Sunkiss Queen, man, she's on time with her readings too. And Jazz, they, they both are great. And I'm just giving a shout out to them. And these, these are really the only two in the spiritual community that I could just follow. You know, a lot of them, you follow them a little bit, and then they say something that's so far left or far right till you say, ooh, I, I, ooh, no. You know how it just leave a bad taste in your mouth, but go check them out. Sunkiss Queen and Journey with Jazz, okay? And uh, don't forget my podcast <laughs> on Spotify. I'm going to leave uh, the details, a link in this, this chat. But uh, forgive me for the mistakes in the beginning because I, I, you know, I try to understand what they're telling me to do. And then I write notes. And the bad thing, when I write the notes, I don't even understand what I've written. And my son told me, he said, Mama, you might have to record yourself and talking about what you wrote because if you don't remember what you wrote or why you wrote it, it it's not going to do you no good. I said, oh, so I need to record myself talking about how to do it. You see, yeah. So I guess I'm going to try that route. But the the last podcast was better. I just got to learn how to edit them. Because, you know, but, but follow me. Y'all, follow me to the end. You'll get the gist of it, okay? <laughs> oh, there's something else to do. But anyway, guys, the main thing is for y'all to check out these two uh content creators because it's a uh, they woo, honey 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 i can let them drive me on in i can get in the back seat and go to sleep because they some good drivers okay i'm gonna talk to you later bye bye